hi guys so in today's video i'm gonna be doing um a makeup collection video so i'm gonna pretty much show my collection and where i have it stored and um pretty much my little area of heaven i can i guess you can say because it's like this is like my part of the room like obviously me and my husband share our room and this is like my side where i have it like decorated and very girly to like you know to what i like um so yeah i wanted to share that with you guys i have had it requested to do my collection by a couple of my subscribers so i just wanted to do it because i am very proud of my collection it does take you know a lot of time and mostly money to you know collect these things i don't have a huge collection but i feel like i have a pretty decent collection yeah guys i just wanted to show you guys my collection now this isn't to show off or anything i know i've seen a lot of uh, videos of makeup collections and that is something that they say that they're not trying to show off what they have they just you know we're all proud of our collections i mean if you guys have a makeup book if you guys have a makeup collection i'm pretty sure you guys are proud of your collection because you just love to see it there every time you want to do your makeup or play with makeup and you see it you feel happy um but for the most part since this is an investment and these products don't cost a little bit i do do my research before buying something um i'm not just like some kind of like compulsive buyer and i just buy whatever is coming out and that's just a little intro guys of uh my makeup collection so i hope you guys enjoy it i do enjoy watching makeup collection videos and if you guys have a makeup collection i would really love to see your collection so enjoy this video i'll see you guys next time bye This is where my makeup collection starts. Well, the video starts. So this is pretty much um, some of my like blushes, bronzers. Um, my like the way that I have it organized, like it's not like super perfect, but it's way better than it was before. So um, yeah, so I have some blushes here, contour. This is the Lorac. This is Profusion. Um, and then I have Kat Von D, and then I have, um, which one was this from? Um, Coastal Scents. This is, like, one of my first, like, blush palettes that I got. Um, and then here I have some mascaras, like, um, some eyeliners, and then this one's, like, my concealers. You can't really see that much. I know it's kind of dark. My concealers there we go it's better you guys might see a little you know dirtiness from my makeup and my nails are not very cute but anyways so yeah my concealers are back there and then I have my moisturizers right here I love these um all of these um moisturizers I really like um the only one that I don't like that much is my glam glow one which is not very moisturizing but it smells so good and it looks very nice so this is a mask that I've been using um, and it actually warms up your face when you put it on. It's like the coolest thing, I think. And then I scoop it up with this, which is like all oily because there's some there. And then these right here are just like some testers. And oh, I love this. This is like my favorite like moisturizer. And then over here, I have some of my palettes. So you guys already know which ones these are. This one's Juvia's Place. This one's the Morphe one, oh, 24G, Jaclyn Hill. This is like the first one that she came out with, so it gets dirty very easily. These are Morphe. These are like single eyeshadow Morphe, and they have like two MAC ones that I got. Um, this one is um, the Thirsty Palette. I haven't made a video on that. The Blood Sugar. Um, and then these are... This is a Sephora collection one. This one's a Profusion one. Um, and I do like to put my palettes like by size, like by the tallness. Not like by the longness, but like by tallness. And then I have um, the Dominique Cosmetics, the KKW, the Laura Lee, the first one that she came out with. 
And then up here, I have some setting powders. Um, you guys can see which ones I have. And then um, I have that one, the Too Faced. This is like my favorite of how it smells. So they all perform pretty the same. This one I got it like a while back when it was like coming out a lot on YouTube. And um, I mean, I like it, but I stopped using it. And then um, in here I have some eyeshadows, like kind of like single eyeshadows, um, ColourPop, you know, the baked powders by um, that I got at JB and Eves, which I really like. And then I have like this loose pigment, and then these loose pigments as well. And yeah, this is like one of the like first. And I know it's like so dirty and. This is like one of the first makeup, the first makeup that I got from um, Bare Minerals, and I still have it. Like, I just don't get rid of my makeup because I really do like it. Okay, and then the next drawer I have some eyebrow stuff, um, the Anastasia, and then I have um, some Stila like liquid eyeshadows, and then this is some from Shop Miss A liquid eyeshadows. Um, and then I have eyeliner, some e.l.f. back there, oh, yeah. and then this one is for MAC, the paint pod, which I need to use it more, and I actually kind of want to get more of those. In there. And then in this one, I have some highlight, some blush, some bronzer everything like Too Faced and I have MAC and then I have the Balm and then from Shop Miss A and then this is one from Benefit I really like this one this one I just got I love this Chanel one this is like my only Chanel product because it's like so expensive and this is the one the only thing I haven't finished like I had the powder and a blush and I actually finished both of those and that's how it looks like now but i love how it smells and this one is the color i don't know what color it is but i have that one so yeah this is just more blushes because i have the other palettes and then i have more blushes more blushes i love how this one smells Oh, and then this one right here. This one right here, like, I really like how it's, um, like, the flowers and stuff. Like, it doesn't work that great. Like, the color is not all there. There's, like, sh more shimmer, I think. Like, it doesn't work as well as it should. But I really like, you know, the packaging, I guess. And then over here, I have all my lip products. Well, most of my lip products which I have um, MAC, Morphe, um, L'Oreal, Urban Decay, I have some Too Faced, and then I have um, some Kylie right here, these are my Kylie, and then I have, whoa, <laughs> then I have one from um, Huda Beauty, and then this one is the one that I have from, from RK by Kiss, I actually like that one. And then I have this one by Ciate. This is the one where like you put your lips together and then it gets like shimmery. And then I have um, NYX, that one's NYX. And then this one's the Flower Beauty. And then like this one's Profusion. And then I have some lip liners. And then this is like the Ofra one. And then I have like a whole bunch of like Smashbox ones. And then I have I have um, this one, Very Lonely by Lancome, and then, uh, let's see, and then these are Too Faced, I love this packaging, let's take a quick look at it, because it's so pretty, look how pretty it is, you can see the little peaches there, I love this packaging, I wanted to get more, but I only got these, oh, it's not closing, and then i have these these are really good for the lips and they have lasted me a very long time 
and then I have Jeffree Star. I really, really like his um, his whole packaging, like his themes, his colors, and the formula is it's good. I like the formula on mostly all of them. I didn't really, really like the formula too much on this one. This is the summer collection one, and this is a this is a color coral fixation. And this one, it was a little bit like streaky, but I mean, I'll still make it work. I still like the color once it's. You know, I fix the streakiness. You know how I told you guys that I love palettes, right? Well, here's the rest of my palettes. Well, some of them. Um, well, more of my palettes. So right here, I try to put like all like um the ones that are like um like the most most affordable ones. Um, these are like my most affordable ones that I have. Um, the Carly Bible. And then, um, it's kind of hard to see in here. And then here I have my Naked palettes. And this one's like the Modern Renaissance Unique as well. And then the colors, are, I feel like they're really nice, you know? Like, I feel like this palette like came and it went like so quick. So I guess I have that one. And then these, I have the chocolate palettes. I don't know why, sometimes I like to just leave them in their package because... They just look so nice in the package and then this is just the package i don't even have that in there and then i have the naked two and then i have more two face palettes and then i have this one that was the gwen stefani um collab with urban decay and then i have more two face and then i love this violet Voss one and i do plan on taking them out from the package like sometime soon and then, then I have that's Too Faced, that's Too Faced, that one's Too Faced, and then more Too Faced, Too Faced, and then Huda Beauty, and then some Lancome right here. So yeah, so that's more of my eyeshadow palettes because that's like what the number one thing that I was obsessed with. And then next I have here, um, this is where I keep like my perfumes and some, some of my jewelry and my purses. Um, and then these, my sister gave me these, the world's greatest mom, and the, because I have a sister, I'll always have a friend. She's so sweet, <laughs> because I'm, like, such a great sister. <laughs> and then I have, um, some of my purses here that are, like, my favorite purses. My perfume's not part of my makeup, but I love perfume as well. And then right here, I have some jewelry. And then right here as well, like I have some of my jewelry. And then, so that's that. And then I love this little carpet right here. And then this right here is pretty much like where all my like most expensive makeup is at, which is um, my Marc Jacobs like palettes and stuff. And then well, my foundations, but it's mostly um, like what I really, really like like the most because it's like the packaging and it's like really pricey so I put it in here and then down here I have like my expensive eyeshadow palettes like my most expensive eyeshadow palettes um the Kat Von D one like I wouldn't really say that one's like expensive expensive like super high-end but I just really like the packaging and also the Too Faced one like really like the packaging so I just put it here with my Natasha Denona and my Pat McGrath palettes and that color right there that lipstick right there is my most expensive lipstick which I think is like $35 so I put it there because um, I don't buy those all the time because it's a crazy price for a lipstick it's only on rare occasions of um, foundations like drugstore and high-end okay so I turned off my flash because it was kind of reflecting right here but right here I have like my MAC collections stuff um pretty much collections that i've gotten from mac which is like the patrick star um summer collection the Aaliyah collection and um the other patrick star collection and those two in the middle these two right here these are like i really like how they smell they smell so good and then they look so nice and then in the back i have my my thick ugh, my mac fix plus so yeah, that's pretty much it guys. That's my makeup collection and I love that Chanel and Tiffany. And then that right there, my mom actually made that for me.